Oh man, I've never seen, I don't have good luck at unpacking stuff. Hello folks. Well, today I received my Armitan aircraft grade CNC 355 cut aluminum quadcopter from Brian's Flyin. Well, Brian and Chris at Armitan have been custom making quadcopters from CNC cut aircraft grade aluminum. And they're pretty cool. Both Armitan and Brian's Flying sell frames, full kits, and receiver ready versions. You can find them both under the multi rotor section and RC groups for more information about kits or on YouTube. I'll put some links in the video description notes, so make sure to check them out. Well anyway, by getting it from Brian, uh, who will actually custom build any frame type quad for you by the way, he sent me his custom built one with the latest firmware flash from Simon K uh, for the ESCs and also the latest firmware for the KK version 2 board which adds auto level function to the 5th channel. All that flashing of firmware setting up and testing was well worth it to me to have Brian's fly and do it. Well I can tell you this thing looks indestructible and heavy. but. Since the motors and ESCs are both from MyRCMart.com, it only costs 10 bucks each. So if you ever damage one, the parts are very inexpensive. You know, and the control board is the KK version 2. And uh, I got to tell you, this board is so much different than the first KK boards. I could rave about it all day long. Well, it's very smart with a full-blown, very easy to read and program menu on a lighted LCD screen. There's no computer needed, so you can program it from the X to the plus configurations, gyro sensitivity, self-testing of sensors, trimming, auto level, etc. You can configure it to even be a tricopter, quad, or even an octo with eight motors. To arm the board, you just simply push the rudder stick to the right. To disarm it, move it to the left, which puts it in the safe mode. If no movement is detected at any time after 30 seconds, it automatically goes into the safe mode. This is really a great safety feature. And since the board only costs $29.95, I just don't know how they can do it. The words are even spelled out. It says forward or back, and you know exactly what each stick is doing as you program it. It's a real jewel, and uh, Brian, you dialed it in perfectly. You know, if you buy one from uh, Brian's Flying, I know that he makes a video of it, and uh, you get to see it flying, and he's also on call, personal call, and guarantees his machines will work perfectly. That's a pretty good deal. He'll even call you and walk you through the setup for your transmitter, so you can't help but succeed. I was impressed, and I'm pretty anxious to try it. Okay, well, what you're going to want to do is turn on your radio and, and plug in your battery to the... Uh all right, hang on. Hang on. This thing isn't going to take off in my face, is it? No, sir, it's not. It's okay. in safe mode. It will not arm at this time. Okay. Oh, now it says okay, 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 okay. And now it should. I'm going to take this thing outside. I'll call you and let you know. Thank you. This is so very cool, Brian. This is smooth. Well, I've got my bird all decked out. I use my noodles on here for soft landings and uh, put some orientation on there too. Uh, the bird is pretty heavy uh, compared to some of my other quads. The thing is, uh, that may be a good advantage because all of my very heavy airplanes fly in the wind. Much more uh, stability. And I can tell you how much this weighs. It is um, right at 509 grams as I have on here. That's like a pound and uh, four ounces. So uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, take it outside and see how it flies and uh, if it flies good I'm going to put the GoPro up on top which looks like it. Man I like this little feature here. It's all uh, lit up nicely. If you want to arm it you just give a little right and hold the rudder and it's armed. I'm ready to go. After you land, if you hold left, it goes to safe. Let's just lift up and see what happens. Just, uh... It wants to fly, so let's go fly. Oh, no. 
think this thing is going to go. Oh, wow. I mean, really wow. Okay, there's the temperature. You did a good job. I like this a lot. This is absolutely fantastic. Let's plug this in. Put the neon lights on it. Put the uh, red light on the front this time. See, as soon as this moves, it will turn on. I forgot where that tree is. No leaves on it, it's hard to see the tree. Well, thanks a lot for watching folks. I'm glad Brian was able to call me and get this set up for me. It works perfectly. Stay tuned because we're going to have some more exciting flights including 3D.